Hey guys, this is Mike Cornell. I wanted to make a video on startup funding. And um, so wanted to just run through that really quickly, make this short and sweet for you guys, okay? So what is startup funding? It's obviously the name startup funding. So if you're starting a new business and you're wanting to, maybe you need some cash to start it. Um, yeah exactly what it says uh, you can apply for it as long as your credit is good enough and your debt debt is good enough as well so you got to have limited debt as well so um, this is definitely an option okay so what is startup funding we talked about that what are the requirements for startup funding I'm gonna go through so I have three lenders that I work with that I can help you with and I'm just gonna go through some of the requirements that they want Okay, so and before I say that, uh, I want to just talk about a lot of wholesalers, DTS wholesalers, um, you know, they've been doing business out of their personal account for years, which doesn't help them when it comes to lending and getting business business funding. It doesn't help them, obviously, because they have no track record in the LLC world and, you know, the business world. So, um that is um, that's an issue that a lot of DTS wholesalers are dealing with. So if you are a wholesaler and you haven't got your business bank account and you haven't got gotten your LLC established, um, this is this is for you. You need to go do that now so you can start getting some history. All right. So that's that. So if you're one of those people, there's another option. OK, there's what's called startup funding just like we said okay and i'm going to go over so if you're a dts wholesaler and you've been doing business out of your personal account um this is for you you as long as you can show uh the income in your account and we're going to go over some of the requirements here okay so what is the maximum amount of funding a single person startup can qualify for the answer is $250,000. You can qualify for up to $250,000. Um, what is the credit risk? What is the credit score requirement to be able to uh, um, apply for one of these loans and obtain them? And the answer is um, 650, right? So the least amount of credit you need is 650. That's the credit score that you need. Okay. And um, preferably 680, okay? And um, all right, that's that. So what is basic documentation you would need for startup funding for the different companies? Well, I'll tell you, uh, one of the lenders we use, all you need is a tri-merged credit report, which is basically a report showing all three scores. And um, what I'll do is I'll put the website in the description so you can go there and get your uh, credit report, uh, all three of them at the same time. It only costs $1. Um, I need that before, I actually need for you to get that um, so that even before we get on the phone, so I know what your credit score is. So if you wanna book like a, a call with me, um, I'm gonna need that credit, that credit report before we talk about startup funding okay so with one of the lenders all you need is uh, that report and what they do is they take pretty much they take your information and they take it to all the big banks and they literally um, will apply for a startup fund on your behalf and um, some of you are gonna ask well why don't I just do that myself uh, most people get rejected at the bank, including me. I had phenomenal, um, phenomenal income. Um, you know, I was top one, one, one percent, and you know, I still got rejected. And um, it makes sense because I wasn't as organized as I should be as a business, you know. So, anyways. So it's not just about your income um, and your credit. It's like it, there's more things to it. With when it comes to the bank, it, there's more qualifications and stuff like that. Uh, okay. So one of the lenders, all you need is a credit report. 
Okay, and I told you about the website. And then another lender that we use, um, you need a 680 and you need two years of tax returns showing you made over 50K. And you also need, um, let's see, a, okay, 680, the credit report, the tri merge credit report, and then two years of tax returns showing 50K or more. Um, so that's pretty much it guys about startup funding. If you want to explore more options, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my website in the description so that you can, uh, send me your information and then, you know, I have one of my assistants reach out to you and then, you know, we can get the process started and, um, get that going. Okay. All right. So two different, and I just want to go over two different links in the description, the try merge credit report, and then my website. So you can send me your information and we can reach out to you. All right. See you later.